Hey folks, this is Decoherent, and welcome back to Hitman. So last time, we successfully navigated a fashion show. I was beautiful. It was amazing. Today, we're heading off to the world of tomorrow. Good morning, 47. Your destination is the coastal town of Sapienza, also known as the jewel of the Amalfi Coast. Of course. Your target is a former client of ours, Silvio Caruso, a brilliant but troubled bioengineer employed by the Ether Biotech Corporation. Ooh. Renowned for his early stem cell research, Caruso is now reportedly working on a far more disturbing oh, project. Oh, great. A DNA-specific virus able to infect anyone, anywhere in the world. Imagine a bullet fired in any direction, passing through countless bodies without inflicting harm, invisible and undetectable until it strikes its target. I know how viruses work. A world of armchair assassins killing with impunity. This is what awaits us, unless Caruso is stopped. Our client, one of Ether's major private stockholders, wants the project cancelled on ethical grounds, mm. but without destroying the company in the process. She has asked us to eliminate Silvio Caruso and destroy the yet unfinished virus prototype. All right. You will also need to deal with Caruso's lab head, Francesca DeSantis, a high-level Ether employee and cutthroat corporate climber no who holds intimate knowledge of Caruso's research and could potentially carry on in his place. Okay. This is no ordinary contract, 47. Caruso's virus is a serious threat to our craft and trade, not to mention our core ideals. So failure is not an option. I'll leave you to prepare. It's fine, we'll just go poke around a biosafety level 4 area. This will be great. I love this plan. Alright, so, objectives, kill them. Um, um, I don't know, let's just do this. Welcome to Sapienza 47. Hello. Silvio Caruso's family home is right across the square. The bioengineer suffers from acute travel phobia. So the Ether Corporation has installed a state-of-the-art field laboratory somewhere below ground. Oh, easy. Expect security levels to rise as you get close to the virus. Well, thank you. All right. So what do we have for intel? Should be nothing all that interesting yet. Yeah, we haven't had a chance to really find anyone yet. Beyond the grave, candlelight, catharsis, memento. Okay. Well, let's go take a look. Let's try just walking in the front door. Sometimes that works out for you, you know? No reason not to give it a try, right? Hey guys, how's it going? You need clearance to pass. You don't have it, buddy, so, uh... Hmm, okay. Alright, so clearance. What would clearance look like? Would clearance look like hopping over a wall? Let's find out. I mean, clearance could involve, like, murdering them messily. Where are my pants? Personally, if he's unhappy with you, I'll get the blame. I could get fired. Is that what you want? Oh, please. Like, you want to wait on that weirdo Caruso for the rest of your life? Come on, you gotta think big, sis. This man, all this here is just temporary. Mm. Oh, that weirdo is your boss, Rocco. So get your shit together and you're asked to work pronto. It's almost lunchtime. Chef Sounds good. Has hired a new kitchen hand by recommendation, and the two have yet to meet. Could be a convenient way to infiltrate the mansion. FYI, according to our research, Chef Marcello has been trying to replicate Isabella Caruso's famous home cooking, but Silvio Caruso is not impressed. Fair enough. I suggest you give him a helping hand. I think I shall. I am good cook, I imagine. Um. Okay. Whoa. Sorry. My bad. I'm just, you know, hanging up. Could I interest you in some rotola? It's local. Or let me know if you want something else. Ah, so what do we have here today? Let me think. Briskets looking good. Yes. Yeah, it is. Is there another way in here? I mean, I can just make my way in. Hello. This is probably trespassing. Oh, it's not. Okay. Well, we'll go address that guy in a little bit here. All right. I have that same lamp. I'm just saying, in like two of the rooms of my house. 
Okay, so this guy's up on the top floor. Let's go find him. We're going to be polite. We're just going to, you know, knock him out. Everything's going to be cool. We are friendly assassins. I think I'm on the wrong level. Um. See, these are opened. Hello? Oh, this is just a bathroom. Not that interesting. Well. I don't have any way to open the door. I could just ring the bell. Let's just try that. Hello? Hello? Okay. Well, it was worth a try. No dirty laundry, huh? Alright, so let's find a key. Wait, did that door just open? Yes, it did. Whoa, come back. Hello? And a good day to you, sir. Good day. Thank you. Just subdue. Everything's fine. Uh, did he just say grandma? Okay. So, what do we have here? A mansion key card. Excellent. That will be helpful. Okay. And what do we got going on back here? Here's our nice new clothes. Don't worry, I'm going to move him out of the way. I'm going to come drop him in bed. Then he'll have a good time. And what's this? An apartment key. Excellent. I'll need that to get back in. All right, buddy. Let's drop you off in bed. You'll wake up and this will all be, well, not a good dream. But if you wake up next to your bed, you won't find it quite as weird as it might be. Okay, so let me take a look out here quick. It's pretty. All right. Very nice. Anything else in here that I can take with me? Empty soda cans. Nope, nope, nope. Um, we're going to go meet the chef. It's really cool, but okay. Question is, now can I get back behind the counter? There might be something interesting in there, and I like interesting things. Let's find out when we get down there again. Are any of these doors openable, by the way? Oh, it's a safe house. Really? Oh, neat. Okay, well, what do we have in here? Um, yet another bathroom. Okay, everyone likes bathrooms. Conceal item. Ooh, interesting. Okay, that goes outside. Hold on. Safe house. Okay, so there's a gun, but we don't want to carry that. People will notice that. Actually, can I carry it and just keep it holstered? I, I could... I don't think it's a good idea, to be honest, but let's take it anyway. No, it's that's loud, isn't it? I don't want loud. Light tactical pistol, underpowered, drop it. I don't need that. Hello. Explosive golf ball? Uh, yes. Thank you. A golf ball that detonates on contact. <gasps> Kitchen knife? Can never go wrong with a good knife. I mean, I'm probably not going to use a knife. I like killing people quietly. Although, I don't know how I'll knock off this guy. This should be interesting. Alright. So, what's going on in here, then? Or out here, rather. Oh, this will be a convenient back way into the property, won't it? Well, maybe not. That might be quite a drop. Hello. Is this where I just was? Yes. <laughs> okay. Well. Okay. Well, let's go on in and find the chef, huh? Uh-oh. That guy will notice us. Is there someplace I can drop him? Yep. Pick up a brick. I don't want to hit him with a brick. That just sounds rude. Oh, it's that nice lady. Who, unfortunately, I missed. Hmm. Agility. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be careful when entering windows. Okay. Gotcha. Drop. Dude. Okay, and let's keep an eye out for her. Because she seemed nice. And if we can avoid hurting her, that would make me happy. Let's just unlock all the doors. It's better to have doors unlocked, right? Because then when something bad happens, I've got an easy way out. Alright, so our target's way back there. So, nice lady, can I avoid you? Probably. Let's take a look around. Aha! 
So that's probably the guy we need to talk to. Got anything good in here? Overflow the sink. We can hide something in the trash can. Okay, why would we want to overflow the sink? That's an interesting question. Okay, nobody out here seems to care about us. We've got a fire alarm, a place to hide a body, a radio. We'll just leave it alone. And what's in here? Um, expired can of spaghetti sauce. Yes. That's, that's weird, mind you, but okay. And a window that we could potentially go somewhere for, but I can't see it. So I'm going to not do that at the moment. Why would I want expired spaghetti sauce? I love these options. Okay, something we can go into. Medic rat poison. Very good. Why is there rat poison sitting around in here, you may ask? The answer is I have no idea. Hey, buddy. Sorry. Jeez. Aren't you a jerk? So, can I just cook at these then? Turn off the stove. I can poison the pot. Well, obviously, we're not going to do that. People will notice. Anything else over here I can nab? So the question is, do we want to play the cook? I'm I'm feeling like a cook. Let's play the cook. Hey, buddy. Chef Mocello. I'm the new kitchen hand. Sorry, I'm late. You're damn right you are. <sighs> Never mind. Yeah, you can finish this tomato sauce. Maybe you can get it right. I seem to be jinxed. All right. When you're done, bring the dinner. Sure thing, boss. I'll give it some love. Yes, I shall. Is there anything else over here I can pick up? Um, blend in. Yeah, that's good. Well, um, I mean, obviously we're not gonna. Oh, here we go. We can just cook it as a kitchen assistant. Perfect. Yes. Looks kind of like worms. All right. Well done. Now, I could poison it, but if I do that while well, he's paying attention, that's not going to work as well. Actually, I'd have to get it past all these guys. I wonder if I could do that. I'm feeling clever. What if I turned off the radio? Would he walk over and mess with the radio? Come on, give me a break. So, go turn on the radio. Oh, let's see if I can get this. Oh my god. If this works, this will be so clever. Expired can of spaghetti sauce. Um, yeah. Let's do that. I don't I don't know why I did that. But I think that was a good idea. Okay, dinner bell. Uh, dinner bell is outside. Is anyone out here that's going to know me? Doesn't look like it. Okay. There's something over here. A brick. You can never go wrong with bricks. Dinner bell. Caruso will be coming to lunch shortly. His last meal, I presume. I hope so too. Okay. So we've got that taken care of. We could knock that guy over, but we're not gonna do that. That would be dumb. Okay, let's try to go Ooh, okay, here what's going on over here? Got some drinks. So it's possible that he might come down here and want to have some lunch. And possibly we'd be able to poison him then. I like that plan. Okay, where does this lead me? Another place to drop somebody. Because there's that guard back there. I could, like, knock him over. But I don't think that's very safe. Let's take a look around other places first. Oh, hello. You look like a ne'er-do-well. Okay. I've been recorded by a security camera. I, d I don't know what that means, by the way. So I don't know what the point is of that yet. Okay, so guy's going that way. And there's rather a lot of people over here. So I'm not going to knock this guy over. Plus, he's paying attention. There is a door back here. We'll check that. But first, I want to see if this guy is going to come over here. Because maybe he'll just eat the expired spaghetti sauce and die. And that would be super easy. I like easy. Uh-oh. Who recognizes me? Or no, that, that person? Who is that person that recognizes me? Ah, so I could have poisoned the drinks. Okay, that's just like one of the bodyguards or something. Okay. Um, let's try going around. There's a door over here. It's locked. Um, hmm. Well, I can't get back this way easily. Unless that guy's gonna wander around. Ooh, nope, here, someone's bringing him his food. 
Maybe this will be my chance. Maybe they'll send the guy to go get some Tagamat or Peptabismol. Maalox. Something like that. Alright, let's keep an eye out on this. Yep. Why, thank you. Come on, eat up. <laughs> okay. I want to see if this expired sauce uh, has any effect on him real quick. We'll give this just a few more moments. Because if he's going to get sick, then that'll give me a chance to deal with him, right? Maybe? Maybe? Oh, did I bring a gun? No. Oh, yeah, I did. But that's okay. Lethal melee, lethal throw. Okay. Hmm, I was hoping that he would get sick and die. But it doesn't look like it. Wait, hold on. Something's happening. Okay, where's he going? Oh, he's coming this way. Oh, God. Oh, he's still coming this way. Oh, let's hop in here, actually. This is a good idea. Oh, he's coming over here by himself. Hot damn. As soon as he walks past, let's hop out. And let's corrode him. Because I never get to use this. Oops, I probably shouldn't have done that. I probably just should have pushed him over the edge. But this was more fun. Problem solved. Body found? What? What do you mean a body found? Oh, because I dropped it down there. I should have put it in the box. Whoops. Ah. Uh, well. I'm still learning this game. Alright, let's find person number two. And a better disguise along the way would be nice. Oh, hello. A fire poker, so you'll notice that. Okay. So don't steal that. A riding lawnmower. Let's go check that out. Everyone seems to be calm, so I'm just going to walk around here. Check this place out. Look at this. So we can pretend to be a gardener. Can I interact with this? Um, we need a wrench. There's a hoe. Another hoe. So we could go gardener. Oh, we could have used an exploding golf ball. <gasps> now I feel like I really wasted an opportunity there. Now, how long will these guys stay searching? Will they just stay searching permanently? So here's the guy we could knock over. However, I'm going to try not to kill anyone that I don't need to. And I would have to kill these guys. A monster. Crowbars? You can never go wrong with a crowbar. Something might need, you know, prying. A shovel. I don't need a shovel. So what's going on down here? And... Medic rat poison? You can never have too much poison. We could turn on a vacuum cleaner? I don't know why I would do that. Unless I can get these guys to come down here one at a time. They have screwdrivers. And I could use some handyman clothes. Uh, let's try that. Let's see if turning on this brings down just one of them. What the hell indeed? Come check it out. Oh yeah, this is great. And then we'll just politely knock him over. And toss him in the box. I don't even need to do anything with his buddy. Okay, consider yourself subdued, buddy. Uh-oh. Oh my god, release that person right now! Done. Come here. Oh god, help, please! Ah crap. Ah, crap. Well, this is not good. Hunted. Yeah. 
So he must have turned around at the last second. Crap. How long until these guys calm down? They might not. Okay, so this guy just woke back up. That's not good. So this is pretty bad. Now everyone knows who they're looking for. Ah, crap. Alright. Okay. So everyone knows who they're looking for, except for the guy I knocked out, which actually makes a lot of sense. Should I try this again? Yeah, I want to try this again. We're going to do a better job hiding this time. Alright, let's see if I can do a better job. Yes, same guy. Come on down here. Think nothing of it. Come on, come investigate. So that other guy is facing away. I'm not sure how he saw me, to be honest. Maybe I'm just not as sneaky as I thought. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. T, disguise. It's not working. There we go. Come on, dude. Like, these controls sometimes don't work in time. All right. Have a nice nap, buddy. See, now everything's fine. Everything is fine. Everything's just fine. Don't go back and talk to that guy, though, because he might know who I am now. All right. So there's a guy down here that'll recognize us. Oh yeah, it's another uh, another one of these guys. So we can turn off the power. That's an interesting idea. Let's try it. I'm making lots of bad decisions today. Yes, what indeed. Oh, there's two of them. I didn't realize that. Uh, this may not work as well. Okay. Today's plan is Deco plays with everything and makes everyone angry. Let's wait till he turns around. Gotcha. Come here. And into the box with you. We can just turn the power back on. There we go. All fixed. What in the world could that have been? I have no idea. Let's never think about it again. Oh, is that a scientist? Not for long, it's not. Pretty soon, he's me. Perfect. Well, this is good. A lab tech. Excellent. All right, buddy. You know the drill. Into the box. Have a nice nap. Nice. Is there anything over here I wanted? Ooh, what's on the card? A biolab keycard. Key Done. Seems both are reach. Wait, hold on. Look how dapper I am. <gasps> it's amazing. Okay, anyway, sorry. Focus. Deadly seriousness. Okay, I feel like I'm doing well, actually. These guys have no idea who I am. Hey, guys. So... That's the lab. Let me look over here. Specifically, I want to find tools. Because tools can also, you know, are often helpful. So what was this? Another crowbar. I've already got a crowbar. Okay, guards that way. Place to hide bodies. Yeah, so I could overflow the sink if I wanted to. Ooh, that head's downstairs. Okay. But I don't know if that's a downstairs area that I want to go to. Okay, more crowbars. Okay. I suppose it's if I wanted to, like, knock people around. Well, this goes outside. Okay. I can play with the generators. But I don't need to do that because I'm supposed to be here. I'm just casual lab tech. Hello. Sir, sir, you cannot enter these premises. Okay, sorry. Happy I got through to you, sir. Sorry. Jeez. So I gotta drop my gun. Crap. Um I'll drop it back over here, then I won't forget where it is. Ha ha ha. So that will get detected. That's okay. Um, explosive golf ball will not. That's too bad. I really like the gun. I've, have I ever used the gun except for the training round? 
I have not. That's disappointing. Alright, let's go ahead and let's submit to a quick search. Hey, guys. Go right ahead. Check me for illegal guns. This will be over in no time. That's what everyone says. Damn, I just missed the best opportunity for a that's what she said joke. All right, and I'll never remember to go back and edit it. Ah, uh, oh well. Yep, unlocked. Beep. Beep boop. And here we are. Okay, looking good. Yeah, this seems safe. This is where I put my biolabs, by the way, is in old abandoned catacombs. Nice. Okay, now all these techs will recognize me. Thank you. I shall, but first I gotta find something else to wear. Because all these guys are gonna recognize me. Alright. Ooh. Is this a guard by himself? It is. Is there a place to stash him? There is. Is there anyone else here? There is not. Hey, sorry, I just need your uh your clothes, your keys, and your motorcycle. Disguise. Hopefully that doesn't backfire on me. And in you go. And we may as well take the gun. I mean, I'm not going to use it, but then I have some options. See, this is another loud pistol, and I don't want that. Um, a Biolab keycard? I shouldn't have that. So I don't think I need it. Actually, don't I already have one? Oh, did I use it? Well, then I'm going to pick it up, even though I shouldn't have it at the moment, because then I'll have it handy. Okay, so now, those guys down there will recognize me, but the lab techs will not. Okay. So how do I get over there? It looks like maybe heading across and then down. Looks promising. Because we need to stay away from the rest of security. Okay, oh, there's interesting things we could do over there. But first, got to get down this way. I can't quite hear them. Hello. A hammer. Yay. You can never go wrong with hammers. Okay, so I could flip off the generator. That would get a lot of attention, I'll bet. Uh-huh. And there's a box to put people, or to put me. And then I can hop out and grab said people. Oh, like that security guard. But if I do that, I'm going to call down a world of shit on me. Is that really what I want to do? Is that really what I want to do? I'd have to take them all out one at a time. I tell you what, let's stick with it and then hide quick and let's see what they decide to do. And then once I have the answer to that, then I can make some better decisions. Okay, so there's a guard coming up here. Now remember, you can only drop two bodies in these boxes. So let's see what his move is. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah! Damn it! That's not good. No, you didn't. Ah, crap. Crap, I'm screwed. Okay. Well, let's see how badly screwed I am. Yeah. Yeah, that was a pretty bad idea on my part. That was a pretty bad idea on my part. So now everyone knows that I'm... Well, this is no different, being compromised. I mean, everybody already knew I wasn't a real security guard. So I don't think this actually makes anything materially worse. It just doesn't make any better. Okay, you know what? Here's a great plan. 
Since everybody already knows I'm a bad guy, let's do that again. Only this time, I'm gonna hit the right button to knock him out. And not the wrong button. You'll see. I'll totally get it right. Yeah, unfortunately this isn't really gonna help me. But I'm gonna do it anyway. Because I don't know why. Wouldn't it be funny if it turns out that I can't hide in a box that I've dumped a body? That would be awkward, wouldn't it? Okay, come out and turn around. Yep. There we go. Come here. Come here. Okay, now everyone knows who I am. Anyway. Actually, it says I'm no longer compromised. I wonder if I did that again, if I would get that other guy's attention. It seems like those guys won't recognize me, but this guy over here will. Now, can I still climb into a box that has one body in it? The answer is yes. Uh, let's try doing exactly the same. Uh-oh. Crap. Is he going to notice the gun? Or did he already pick up the gun? I think someone actually already came by and picked up the gun from the first guy. Okay, so there's still two of them, unfortunately. This is almost certainly not the right way to do this. Look at a stalactite. Oh. That's interesting. I wonder if I can get one more of these guys. And then I could, like, try to distract them with the stalactite. I like that idea. Is anyone going to come look? Okay, here comes a guy. Oh, and it's not the person I'm looking for. Oh, it's a lab tech. That's not helpful. Because I already have a lab tech uniform available to me. So actually, there's no reason to even bother her. Let's go somewhere else. Calmly. So... How am I going to get down there? See, some of these guards are different. Some of them will recognize me and some of them won't. Is there another way for me to get down? What happens if I throw something at the stalactite? Because that sounds kind of cool, doesn't it? I got a couple crowbars. Oh, that's not quite what I meant to do. Okay, never mind. Well, I learned a valuable lesson about being able to drop things. So, let's see here. So, if I go back to being a lab tech, where can I go? And, for damn sure, please drop that item. Um, weapon. See, I can go some places, but I'll have to be really careful. Let's try this. Let's see if this works any better. Because my first idea didn't work very well. Actually, if I turn off the generator again, will that same person come up then that then won't, you know, necessarily see me on the way? That's not a bad idea. Let's try that. Well, I mean, maybe it's a bad idea. It's probably a bad idea. But I'm going to do it anyway. I'm full of bad ideas today. Okay, so who's coming up to look? Let's see who this is. I can't tell quite yet. My instincts are not sharp enough. Okay, it is another scientist. So I could gank her and dump her in here. Let's wait till she's over here. Okay, turn around. Come here, 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 come here. Quiet. I'm glad you're wearing your safety glasses. Come on, why can't I grab her? See, it's frustrating that the groat mechanic is the only one that automatically switches to dragging. Okay. Hey. Don't mind me. Nothing interesting over here. So we'll let him investigate for a second. Let's keep an eye around here. So there's one guy over there and one guy down there. But I think I'll be able to get past them. Let's take a look at the top of the stairs. Okay, so those two people, I think, are far enough away. 
Let's follow our guard downstairs and let's see what's going on. Just keeping out for windows and stuff. Don't bump into anyone, for God's sake. They don't like that. Wiring, huh? Alright. What's this? Another screwdriver? Whenever you're given the option to have a screwdriver, you probably should take it. Okay, that's a tech that'll notice me. Have a nice day, Doc. Good talking to you. Here, listen. Can you hear this? Interesting. Ugh. Okay, well that's not good. Okay, without a hazmat suit. Nah. All right, that's interesting. Why don't you guys just wander off and go do something else? I'm just gonna come look at this control panel. Pick up biolab safety protocol. Um, yes, I would like to track this opportunity. The central lab unit is kept perpetually doused in chemicals to stop the virus prototype from spreading. Entering without a hazmat suit is sure to be lethal. The air purification system is able to clear the toxin, but the controls are only operated by senior lab personnel. Uh-oh. Break eye contact. Okay, another screwdriver. Gosh, I love screwdrivers. Oh, hello. Start an alarm. Okay, so is that the entrance over here, or is this just some guy? I think it's just some guy. Okay. So where's the entrance? And what's this? A brick? Okay. Okay, is there anyone over here? There is not. Stand up straight. Look like you're supposed to be here. Okay. So where's the entrance? That I wasn't able to tell. Oh, over there. So I need to get all the way around here. Okay, I can do that. A ledge, yeah. Nobody mind me. I'm just a man on a ledge. Pay absolutely no attention. Okay, there's a tech over there. And an entrance over here. And that person's facing away. And that person's right there next to me. Okay, let's try this again. So that guy's going in there, which is unfortunate. Um. Although, actually, which one of these is it attached to? I think it's attached to that one right there, the closest one to us. Which I think I can get at. If we're careful. I think that person is too far away over there to ID us. Let's just waltz on in. And record it on a camera, huh? Okay, that's not good. Okay, quick, dude, you gotta get inside. Someone's gonna recognize me. That person's gonna recognize me. This isn't even where I wanted to be. Ooh, I can use these. Blend in. Oh, just in time. Okay, but on this furtive note, let's go ahead and let's take a break. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.